We put it down to having a lot of people with a lot of experience in the industry. We've, we've got a very good senior bench of very strong people. And so we've got a huge amount of experience in the market and a huge amount of connectivity in the market. Yeah, I think it's down to teamwork, Paul. We've got a super team of, of people uh, on the acquisition side, 23 people experienced in the marketplace, uh, working very hard for some fantastic occupiers. Real bent strength with some real talent coming through to support uh, us in the bigger transactions. And I think the post-Brexit realisation is that life goes on. So not a lot happened in July, not a lot happened in August. People have come back in September. They can't delay their property strategies. Um, it's going to be five, seven years before we really get through the other side of this. So you've got to move forward. So you've got to help people, if you're us, to, to form strategies that build in the flexibility for a different for a whole series of different events over that period. So you've got to be quite sophisticated, uh, you've got to be quite thoughtful, and you've actually got to join with landlord partners that can work with you to achieve that. I think you've got a, a very thoughtful occupier base that uh, quite rightly wants to be uh, certain before it makes commitments. Stigby says, in our experience, occupiers are still pressing on and, and undertaking transactions, but with more due diligence, more flexibility, um, uh, but ultimately still committing to transactions.